Hey guys, what's up? In today's episode, we're gonna be doing something a little different. So from one of the episodes of the Georgia's Office Hours, Absterbone stated that he wanted to see more videos that actually help content creators with their YouTube channel. A lot of these shows, especially KYC, is literally verbatim rereading YouTube policies. So I have been sitting on my chair and I've been wondering on how I can do it. Well, today we're gonna be starting something new. Let's talk about how you can get started on YouTube. So first off, you need to create your own channel. You just have to go to YouTube, log in your Google account, and create your channel. Now that you have your channel, let's get down to business. Let's get down to business. First off, your channel will appear very empty like this one. I haven't done any videos on my channel as you can see right here, but I will get into it and I will make videos. So after creating your channel, what do you do? Here are three things to get started on YouTube. First one is to ask yourself on what do you want to do on your YouTube page. This is the most important question when you are starting on YouTube because you have to ask yourself and you have to assure yourself that you will be having fun when you are creating these videos. If you don't like the kind of content that you are doing, chances are you're not gonna like your YouTube videos and you're not gonna like your channel. So always ask yourself, what do you want to do on your YouTube channel? Is it a gaming channel that does videos about League of Legends, about Overwatch, about tabletop games? Or is it a vlog type? Is it like a food vlog? Or is it like a travel vlog? It all depends on you. It's always up to you. You need to know what kind of channel your YouTube channel should be. The second most important question that you need to ask yourself when you are making your own YouTube channel is can you sustain the kind of content that you are making? So for example, you like playing League of Legends and you made a YouTube channel about League of Legends. Can you make videos of League of Legends regularly, weekly, monthly? Depends on you. You have to ask yourself, do I have the necessary equipment to do amazing videos? Do I have time to record and edit and publish all of my videos about League of Legends? These are the things that you need to ask yourself when you are making your YouTube channel. Now that you have a clear depiction of what your channel will be, and also you have the means to sustain your channel or create videos in the long run, you are now ready to go to the third step. The third thing is you have to create your channel picture, your channel banner, and of course, write something on your about page. These are the things that attracts your audiences to your channel. If you have a good channel picture and a good channel banner that describes and depicts what kind of channel you are, chances are people who are interested in these kinds of content will find you and they will be attracted to your channel meaning more views and possible subscribers. Say for example, you are a photography channel. You make videos that is similar to photography, photo editing, and other similar topics. If I can give you my suggestion on an ideal channel banner for a photography channel, well, what I would do is I will place all of my amazing photos and of course my face or maybe myself holding a camera. For my channel profile, I will be holding a camera or maybe a picture of me holding camera stuff. Now that you have all those three things in the bag and you're ready to make your first video, you can go ahead my friend. Don't worry about your first video. Your first video will always be the best and also maybe your worst video ever, but that's okay. Every YouTuber always starts with that. I remember when I was doing my first video in college, it wasn't that really great. Just create your first video and get your voice out, start learning, start creating, and never give up. All right, Freedom Family, that's the rule of thumb today. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something from the rule of thumb. Let me know in the comment section below what you think about this new show variation. Is it better than the old KYC version or do you prefer this version of the KYC? Okay guys, time to wrap things up. If you like this video, click that like button, of course, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell icon. My name is Nold, guys, and you are watching The Rule of Thumb. Goodbye. Hi, have you checked out our Freedom Forums? If not, well, you should, because you will find me there alongside free channel assets like audios, banners, thumbnails, and a lot more. If you want to hang out with me or with our Freedom staff members, visit our Discord page. See you there.